Hey guys, welcome back to No Catch Your Name. It's me, Ella, and today I wanted to come and make a video about a collaboration that I'm going to be participating in with two other ladies in July for Christmas in July. <laughs> I'm actually going to be participating in two different Christmas in July collabs, <laughs> but uh, so this is one of them. The other one is the one I'm doing with uh, K and K Crochet and other people too. This one is going to be called Deck the Halls Collab. Deck the Halls Collab. Why did I say that weird? <laughs> I don't know. But anyways, so this particular collab, collab I'm going to be participating with Terry at Yarn Joy Podcast and Kim, the Crafty Nomad. So both of their channels will be linked below. If you don't know about them, go check them out. <laughs> They're also going to have uh, introduction videos out and then more videos. So there'll be playlists and all that stuff. But anyways, if you don't know who they are, go check them out. Subscribe to them if you would like to and show them some love and get ready for the collab with us. So the whole point of this collab is about making ornaments for Christmas. And I know some people are like, oh, it's summer. Why are you talking about Christmas? Because, <laughs> one, I love Christmas, okay? Get over it. Two, Christmas comes every year, and almost every year I see people complaining about it like they weren't expecting it. And it's like, hello, it happens every year. You should know it's coming. So why not get ahead of yourself <laughs> and start making things early, you know? And ornaments are little, and you could probably pop them out like one a day if you wanted to, one a week if you wanted to. Um, I like to gift handmade ornaments to my family every year. I do that. My main family, it's my mom, my brother, and my sister, and, you know, their families. Uh, and then myself, because I make myself one, too. <laughs> and sometimes my in-laws. But anyways, uh, it's like a tradition. I make a different amigurumi-like uh, ornament for the family. Um, so I do plan ahead a lot of time. And we usually try to do our Christmas shopping before Halloween <laughs> so that we can enjoy our holiday time, which starts, we celebrate Halloween from August <laughs> all the way through, um, you know, Christmas time and the New Year's and all that. So that's our holiday season here, and we don't want to stress as much as we don't have to, you know. So we do try to finish everything early, and this includes handmade gifts. So for this collab, every Monday in July, which there are five of them, we're going to be putting out videos, sharing. Kim and Terry are going to be sharing uh, ornaments from a specific book, and that book is called Amigurumi Christmas Ornaments by Linda Wright, and I will link that below if I can. I know it's on Amazon because I looked at it, but uh, I got added to the collab a little bit later. I think they were already like talking about it and then they decided to add me because they like me. <laughs> and um, and of course I was like, yes, because it's Christmas. Uh, Kim told me I could use, I could either purchase that book and use it or I can just use whatever. <laughs> so I'm probably just gonna use whatever because I have a lot of books on hand. And plus I have like a million free patterns downloaded on my computer that I need to make because like, what's the point of hoarding them if you're not gonna make them? My birds are being loud. There's a cardinal out there, I think. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, there's a bunch of finches. Um, so I'm going to be using a bunch of different sources. So what we're going to do is Kim and Terry are going to share an emigrumi every Monday from that book. An emigrumi ornament. It's an ornament. Um, and then you can either go to Amazon and purchase it or anywhere else you find it, you know. Uh, that way you have a little bit of time before the collab starts to grab it. So you can either make the ones they're making or you can just pick your own. And then uh, we're all going to also be sharing uh, free patterns too so like the book is paid for you know but then they're going to share a free one as well me i will probably uh just pull stuff off the internet and stuff you know so all of mine will probably be free or ones that i maybe purchased in the past but i will make sure to link them all below and all that so you can get them if you want them and then um yeah so we're gonna be doing that for five weeks total uh for christmas in july so it's gonna be fun we should we'll be able to make some ornaments and you guys can make some ornaments and put them in a little stash somewhere to either give to your friends or to leave around your community as a, um, towards the holiday season as like a, just a random acts of kindness type thing to make, you know, perk people's lives up a little bit. Or you can gift them to people. Or I've seen where some people use ornaments on gifts, like where you put the tag, you put an ornament on theirs too, you know. And it's kind of like the bow or, you know, the decoration. <laughs> but it's also something someone could keep. So it's just cool, you know. It's a lot of uses for crochet Christmas ornaments. But I think it's going to be a really fun collab. So I hope you guys come along with us and participate if you want to. And uh, I would love to see your grasses. <laughs> so if you do participate, please share the pictures with me. You can share them uh, via my email, which is always in the description, or via Instagram. You can tag me on it. My Instagram is also in the description. And also down there is my Facebook group. You can join it and share them on there too. Because uh, I love to see what other people make and it gives me ideas of things to make and different techniques and stuff. So yeah, let's all just do this collab together and have fun. But go ahead and definitely check out the other two ladies. Terry at Yarn Joy Podcast, Yarn Joy Podcast, and Kim the Crafty Nomad. <laughs> so all those links that I talked about will be down below. The book, again, it is called Emigrumi Christmas Ornaments by Linda Wright. 
with a W. <laughs> and um, we can just have fun making Christmas stuff together. And then if you want to, you can also hop over and do the K&K &K crochet one too. Because uh, all the people doing that is going to be sharing free patterns as well. So it's just going to be a lot of cool Christmas things going on in July. So that we can all start getting ready for the busy holiday season. Because if you can finish it now, you don't have to worry about it later. So yeah, like I said, all the links will be down below and I can't wait to see what you guys make and I can't wait to see what Kim and Terry makes as well and what I make because I have no idea what I'm going to make. But I'm going to hop off here and I'll see you guys in the video. Bye guys.